to Betty's cooking channel. Today I'm gonna be preparing for you a meal prep. I know I'm gonna be doing some pork chops, some boiled eggs and things like that. Eggs, and I'm not sure what else I'm gonna make on this video. So keep watching. Today I'm preparing for you some smothered pork chop, keto smothered pork chops. I'm going to rinse these pork chops off and put some seasoning on it. The only seasoning I'm going to use on this pork chop, on these pork chops, is Cajun Creole seasoning. And I show this you that. Seasoning the, this is the seasoning that I'm going to be using on the pork chops. I have one whole bell pepper. I have a half a... Um, onion. I have four garlic cloves that I'm going to use in this smothered recipe and one stick of butter. So let me get everything else. Together. I uh, washed the pork chops off and now I'm going to add the seasoning to it. I have in the instant pot a dozen of eggs that I'm cooking. It's part of the meal prep. That uh, would hopefully I won't have to cook this weekend. I'm gonna put the seasoning all over the chop. Now if you don't if you don't eat pork, you can make this with beef. Same technique. Smothered uh, beef. Uh, Chicken is all good. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to add the vegetables on top. Okay, I'm wash my hands and uh, put the butter on top of the meat. Got the butter here. Butter is at room temperature, that's why it looks like this. Got one more chop on the there. And I'm just going to lay this paper on top of it and it'll melt in the oven. So I'm going to put it in uh, a 400 degree oven for probably about 45 minutes. So I'll let you know if that changed. No prep, I have some asparagus I'm going to cook on my new way. So let me get that started. Notice the instant pot is on, so I'm cooking my eggs in there. I set it on two, two minutes on steam, and we'll see how they come out, okay? I'll add one tablespoon of avocado oil. Actually, it's two tablespoons. These are the asparagus that I'm using. Asparagus spears. I'm supposed to steam them, but I'm going to cook them on medium high. That should be fine. I feel like they already have been pre cooked already. These are the 
frozen time. I like the fresh one, but I didn't see any today, so that's why I picked up this. Um, you get three grams of protein from the asparagus. Um, one gram of fiber. And it's two grams of um, carbs. Serving about three servings per container. So this, according to the flavor, is enough for three people. But actually, it's going to be two of us eating this. So we add some sweet salt on it. Like pepper and cream. And I'm going to add some butter, about a tablespoon of butter. I'm going to go ahead and turn them off now a little bit. Okay, these I just took these pork chops out of the oven. Uh, they cooked exactly. Uh, 45 minutes on 400 degrees so I mean they look delicious okay here's my um, eggs I steamed them for two minutes and I just took the top off the instant pot so hopefully this time they won't be overcooked so We'll see. And um, usually I cook a dozen of eggs every week because these are for snacks. This is what Bill eat in a day. He also has uh, mustard, which is no carbs. Um, and he likes to snack on uh, cashews. So that's what he has in a day. Thank you for watching this meal prep video. And I hope you try to make the pork chops or use the same seasoning for chicken, turkey, whatever you like, vegetables. You can use the same seasoning on anything that you cook. So keep watching.